word is in the NBA world that Devin Booker might be coming to Los Angeles. Ja Power. B B King. Now, this the move I said that will create a dynasty. If the Los Angeles Lakers could get Devin Booker, Anthony Davis, Brian, and Devin Booker, man, they'll be a almost unbeatable team. They'll be an almost unbeatable team. Listen, I said Brian will go on at least play six years with the Los Angeles Lakers. Okay? He going to at least play 60 years with the Los Angeles Lakers. Because look at it. He played the one year with them young boys. He going to at least play five years with Anthony Davis. So they up in this series, right? Let me get it off there. They up in this series three to one. More than likely they going to win. Okay? I don't like to, you know... You know, pour the water before it's cold, but they going to win this series. So then LeBron going to get four. See? And if they acquire a player, because they going to keep retooling the team. If they acquire a player like Devin Booker, man, you just created a dynasty. Now they got up here the Heat and the Timberwolves. Okay. Since the Heat in the NBA Finals, let's look at the Heat. The Heat, you know, they got Bam and Jimmy and, you know, uh, uh, Olenek. Players like that. You see what I'm saying? They got some hero, you know, none and some up and growing stars, right? But why would he go down there with a team that just lost? To the team he could go to, which is the Los Angeles Lakers. They don't got the potential to, the Miami Heat don't have the potential to be a dynasty right now. Okay? They don't have the potential to be a dynasty. Now, the Lakers do. Now, let's look at the Timberwolves. Okay? Now, you got... A nice little team down there, the team that Jimmy actually left. Why would you go to a team that, you know, didn't do right by Jimmy Butler and now Jimmy Butler in the finals? The team he left sitting at home watching him in the finals. So that would be the wrong move, though. They got nice players down there. You see what I'm saying? They got cat and shit. You see what I'm saying? Russell or whatnot. And he an ex-Laker. But listen, if they get Devin Booker, man, they just created a dynasty. Now look at this right here. And I'm telling I'm saying, keep the sign the team pretty much the same. And you know, you upgrade Taylor Horton Tucker. You see what I'm saying? To, you know, a bigger role. <clears throat> and then you uh implement also, Boogie. You bring Boogie into this same lineup, too, to keep the lineup big. Because, see, with Brian and Devin Booker, they'll be able to do what they do with the scoring and defense on the perimeter. You still got uh, Avery Brad Bradley, you know. And I'm going to say one thing about Rondo. Whether it's playoff Rondo or not, and if you look at Brian's career, I always got nervous when he got on the bench. Except, you know, that little time with the Miami Heat, though sometimes they would, uh, you know, uh, lose a lead, or sometimes they would increase the lead. But, you know, look at his time in Cleveland. Brian go out the first time in Cleveland. They might be up, you know, eight points. Brian go sit down for 30 seconds, one minute, 60 seconds, they down two. They done had a down 10-point swing. This man been sitting down 45 seconds. And then, so, you know, then you look at the second time in Cleveland. Even with Kyrie and Kevin Love, if Brian sit down, they might be up 10 points. 
And he goes sit down for two minutes. They tired. And so this the first time that I done felt like, you know, Brian done had, you know, a, a captain leader like Rondo. I never get nervous when Rondo come in the game and Brian not in the game because I trust Rondo. So you got to keep the, 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 the core of the team there. But if you add Devin Booker and add Boogie and upgrade Taylor Hoy and Tucker, and then you get rid of, you know, uh, 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 you know, a bunch of the players that ain't playing cook them and all. You get rid of them. You see what I'm saying? JR too. I'm sorry. I love JR. If you can keep him, man, just you can keep him, man. But if you can't, you gotta get rid of him too and maybe add another little shooter. And there'll be a dynasty. Cause he ain't gonna go to none of these other teams. And if he does Devin Booker done sold his crib down there in Arizona, that's saying he ready to roll. You see what I'm saying? Now if he get it in uh you know the Lakers, you see what I'm saying? That's gonna tell us something something right there. Hell he might even sign with Clutch Sports. <laughs> He might even sign with Club Sports. Is it Rick Paul and shit? Got him another, you know, client or whatnot. So, if 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 the Lakers and Jeannie Bus, congratulations to Rob Palinka and Jeannie Bus, you know, on the early tip, whether we do it in five or do it in six, they gonna get the ring. So the quest for the ring that I said in that preseason game. It's going to automatically, uh, you know, going to come true. Ultimately come true. But everybody hating on Brian or whatnot. Then nobody want to see this man win. If they hating on him now, and he ain't even got the ring yet, imagine what it's going to be like, whether it's Friday, whether it's Sunday. He going to get the ring. And that shit got Michael Jordan sweating. That shit got Scotty Pippen in cognitive dissonance. He don't know what he want to do. You see what I'm saying? But Brian been better longer than Michael Joy. That just facts. He been better longer than Michael Joy. And now he about to have the rings to prove it. And hey, it is what it is. But they going to keep retooling the team. They going to keep the wide key players. Rondo, you see what I'm saying? They're going to keep them. You see what I'm saying? And if the, even if they can't get uh, Devin Booker, which that's the first move they should try to make. Uh, 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 Bradley up there in Washington. See what I'm saying? You know, that might be an option. So Lakers going to keep retooling the team, man. And I can see them winning at least. At the very least, two. But they can easily win three. Especially if they get Devin Book. So y'all like, subscribe, and share, Laker fans. I've been doing videos the whole season, man. And after he, you know, it's all said and done. I got a great video for y'all. Jump out!